Hello, welcome to your tarot and oracle forecast videos for the month of May. I'm going to be keeping these uh, forecast videos kind of short and sweet. So for these, I'm going to be using the Rider Waite tarot cards. I'm going to be drawing a card from the Angels of Light Cards of Clarity deck. And also from this Crystal Angels Oracle Cards deck from Doreen Virtue. So let's go ahead and see what the month of May has in store for you. Capricorn, I'm going to be drawing a card for the focus for you for the month of May. This focus energy is what you are consciously aware of, okay? It's um, what you can focus on. And then I'm also going to be looking at the shadow card, which is the more unaware aspects, um, it's the subconscious, so things that we're not 100% aware of either within ourselves or situations that come up in the month. So we're going to have the light and then we're going to have the shadow. Okay, so show me the cards for Capricorn. Like it's this one. It was a little bit shy and coming out. <laughs> it's interesting that it was shy and coming out. Such as a powerful card, powerful optimism. The sun. The sun is just the power of anything. It's really it's your soul. It's definitely. I think it's absolutely happiness, joy, contentment. That isn't circumstantial, right? It comes from within, and I think you're realizing that. You're utilizing that divine power within you that's not sort of defined by circumstances or situations or other people or whatever that is, you know, really living and utilizing your power. What a strong, positive energy for this month for you. The sun is about hope. The sun is about joy, optimism, looking at the bright side of things. It's also about attitude. Attitude is really everything, right? And it looks like you're going to be Using your power wisely and using your energy wisely, you're feeling very bright. You're a bright light for others as well. The sun is also about leadership, right? Everything revolves around the sun in our solar system. So it's like you're that leader for other people, right? Other people are looking up to you and really how you respond to things, how you handle things. It has to do more of like your attitude than anything. Perfect. I love this for you. Um, the shadow card. Okay. Shadow card isn't bad either. <laughs> this is about wishes. Okay. So what it's saying here is um, this is really the fulfillment of desires, which, you know, is circumstantial. It's like, I want this or I want that. And if it comes, then great. If it doesn't, then that sucks, right? You're feeling... Like that didn't happen. Either way, whether you get what you want or you don't get what you want, you have this sort of like hope. You're like, oh, well, next thing, um, you know, the next thing will come and that wasn't right for me. And it's like you have this sort of grace of accepting that if it's meant to be, it will be. And if it's not, then it won't. You're able to sort of let it go. I, I don't feel like you're going to really suffer from any disappointments this month. You know, and it, it's not not getting your wish. It's just about attitude, really. Um, the disappointment would be the value that you place on something and not getting it, right? Um, but again, it's just sort of having that grace. Like if it's like if it's meant to be, then it'll be. If not, then oh well. Um, on to the next positive thing. I, all around, it looks like a pretty positive month. One of the things um, with the sun is again, it's a joy. It's joy from the inside. It's really tapping into like your true essence, your true nature. That's not circumstantial and just pleasure, pleasurable things, right? Happiness is different from joy, okay? And these are the things that are going to be sort of highlighted, these themes, differentiate, differentiating between the two this month. Either way, it all looks really bright for you. A lot of hope, a lot of... Um, yeah, a lot of good things. Okay, so I'm going to draw a crystal.
crystal card. And if you happen to have this crystal, then you can wear it. You can meditate on it. That's great. If you don't, that's fine too. You don't have to go out and buy it. It's just you're able to sort of meditate or use this energy, visualize this energy. Either way, it's sort of the essence of the thing. It's the message that's the most important here and connecting with that energy. Peridot. Peridot is not actually that easy to get a hold of and it's actually quite expensive. Um, so again, I wouldn't really recommend going out to just buy some. If you want, then great. But if you have it, then also great too. But otherwise, the, the message here is about life's lessons. You can break free from reoccurring negative patterns by praying to know the lesson and blessings that they contain. I'm going to read that again. You can break free from reoccurring negative patterns by praying to know the lesson and blessing they contain. Okay. So I love that. It says breaking free from reoccurring negative patterns. Absolutely. This is the antithesis of negative patterns is positivity, right? A positive mindset, deciding that you are going to be positive, optimistic, joyful, no matter what. Okay. And that's really where your, the power comes from. Um, wonderful. looks like you're going to be breaking free from any negativity using that positivity. Okay. I'm going to draw a card from the angels of light deck here to see what Angels are going to be around the Capricorns. Or what angel you can connect with this month. Let's see what, who is there for you. Angel of awareness. Perfect. This was the awareness, the consciousness, the light, and then you have the shadow aspect. So the awareness will help you tap into sort of angel of awareness will help you break free of recurring negative patterns. Um, okay, so attentiveness to everything occurring in your life provides the knowledge needed to continue moving forward on your path. The angel of awareness directs your attention and consideration to focus on that which you may otherwise neglect to notice. This angel assures that by this observation, you will clearly see your growth opportunities. Perfect. Okay, Capricorn, so this was your message for the month of May. Thank you so much for watching and liking and sharing my videos and for subscribing to my channel. If you would like a personalized reading, please feel free to contact me through my website, sungoddessashley.com. I will leave a link in the description box below. Otherwise, I will see you in the upcoming videos. Take care and be well.